Good morning. Ah, oh, quick vlog. I don't even know why I'm vlogging because um, <laughs> I'm in a mood. I've been in a mood for days. And it's very secular, meaning that uh, it's about every 26 to 28 days I get in this mood. Gosh, the boys aren't kidding when they uh, when they tease about our uh, cycles or PMS, huh? I used to get really mad. I'd be like, "It's not that. You're just using it as an excuse for your poor behavior." And in hindsight, I realized that I might be a little bitchy during this time of the month. A little extra sensitive, a little extra emotional, but I guess it goes with the territory. So at least, at least I see it, right? <laughs> um, one of my biggest problems when I have my period is that I hate everything I put on to wear to work. So I just spent... 30 minutes going through outfits after outfit after outfit and not being happy with anything including oops including the one I'm wearing right now I've never worn it before it was a um it was a hand-me-down it's a little summer dress with a shrug I don't even know if it's work appropriate or not but oh well it's 70 degrees out today right now so I think that's gonna get up to 80 so quick update on the house, um, HCG I haven't weighed, but um, my hubs and I talked last night and we are probably going to um, do another round. Well, he does his own thing, I do HCG, he does um, the amino diet, so uh, which is very similar. So anyway, um, I'll probably do another round in another month or so, providing everything go through here with this house situation. Um, and with the house situation, uh, part of the problem is, is that, you know, they go out and do comps to do an appraisal and we're in a brand new community who only has that, which only has a select few of our model home and then our model home with upgrades and, and the lot that we got, we got an upgraded lot size and so on and so forth. Um, it appears that the appraiser had low balled the appraisal, but he didn't really have much to compare it to. So, um, that puts us in a position when it comes to our loan because obviously the loan is not going to be for more than what the house appraises for, which means that the buyer, aka us, has to come up with more cash on top of what we're already using as a cash down payment, on top of all the other cash that's coming out of pocket, you know, for a new move, including, or for a new house, including, you know, the move and, and then things we have to do when we get into the house. Um, so we did not want or need that added expense and so we're kind of fighting back with the builder and um, yesterday we found out that they're going to go and do comps against another um, another builder in the area so um, so hopefully that does the job because the bottom line is, is if it's not our problem and we walk away from this it's going to be the next buyer's problem and the next buyer's problem. Um, so really, essentially, this is the builder's problem, and he needs to fix. They need to fix it. So um, that's about it. I'm trying not to stress over it. I'm realizing, um, you know, I have to constantly remind myself that um, sometimes what appears as a setback is actually a setup, and sometimes things happen for your own good, even if you can't see it. And so this may know turn into something it may not but stressing over it and how I react to it in the interim is just not going to change the outcome of the situation it's just gonna make me crazy so I am uh, trying to be own Zen I haven't been but I'm working on it and I think I'm getting a little bit better at it so it's just the timing is bad I'm over I mean generally Generally speaking, I don't overreact to situations, but if Tom's in the house, it's almost guaranteed. So, all right, guys, that's it. I want to do a short, simple, quick update. I haven't weighed. I'm going to my naturopath doctor today just to check in with her. And um, my ultrasound is next Monday. Um, I don't really have anything more than that right now to report. So, 
I hope you're all doing well, and I will talk to you again very soon. Peace out.